Oh man, Fox fans, you guys already know we're back. This time with another little small poly bag review. And you know, to be honest, this is actually one of the cooler poly bags I've opened in a long time. And uh, yeah, I was like, my gosh, I gotta pick this thing up. We just picked it up at our local Walmart store. And again, it was like four bucks. So I just, I was like, I gotta get it. Uh, for a lot of you Spider-Man fans out there, because this is like a must have, right? I mean, look at that. Awesome, especially the figure, because I don't have a Spider-Man figure. Um, so let's get into it. You guys already know, look at that. That's my uh, Fortnite, you know, my clan back there. If you guys are curious about these figures, by all means, check my other videos. I did an unboxing these things. These things are sweet, man. You can set them on your desk. You can put them, you know, wherever. I mean, I thought it's cool. I leave a couple of these on my desk at work, and I think they are sick. Um, some of you guys always want to see the packaging. Check it out. Uh, kit number 30451, Spider-Man's mini spider crawler, which is kind of strange. I mean, why does he need a spider crawler? I mean, can't he just do that stuff himself? I don't know. Um, 73 pieces. And again, every single one of these pieces is a, I think, used and genuine piece in this kit, right? They didn't waste on an extra little small spider. They just said, hey, look, we're going to put it all on this particular kit, which is awesome. And I think it was like $3.99. The parts per parts per cost ratio is definitely awesome with this kit. You get a Spider-Man figure. You get these awesome, cool pieces that I think come together nicely. So, hey, we love it. So let's get into the actual little thing itself here. Uh, first things first, let's look at the actual Spider-Man. Believe it or not, I don't have any uh, Spider-Man minifigs. This is like my first one. Or I might have one, but I just don't know where it is. But I think this is actually my very first one. And nonetheless, I like the blue, I like the red. Nothing too special, the, the you know, the, the bottom pants, the, the legs, I mean, they're kind of a, a standard blueprint. The upper torso and everything, I do not know if this is used in another kit or not. I assume so, since it's a poly bag, they tend not to go exclusive on them. But still, nonetheless, I think that, uh, you know, the minifig is still cool. W you know, do I wish it would have came with a weapon like this on this Chimera? Oh my gosh, yes. But you can't, you know, you can't expect much for three bucks. Now, the actual little ride here, the little Spidey thing here, is pretty cool. I mean, the legs move, like you can line them all up like this, right? Put them all on the side. You can kind of move them to the side to give it more of that spidey look, which I think it really does it for me, right? I mean, look at that thing sitting there. Oh, gosh, that looks awesome. That is, you know, you're a Spider-Man fan. Just get this little poly bag for a few bucks. And <laughs> Does that not look awesome? What do you guys think of that? I mean, you guys can check it out over there, but I still think that this looks freaking awesome does have of course the dual controls up front these little things here so not too bad and again pretty much all the other pieces are mimics right you get almost you almost get eight of each piece right pretty much eight legs eight top pieces eight lowers it's pretty much doing the same thing eight times so you should be able to put this thing together very very quick i mean again i mean maybe tops it's gonna take you i don't know five minutes <laughs> build eight of the same thing put it all on the put it all on the actual base squish it together build a little kind of web shooter thing back here and you are good to go. Overall, great deal. I think they did an awesome job on this poly bag. It is one of the first poly bags where I'm like, okay, yeah, I really like it. I did like this one, if you guys remember, um, the Iron Man one, I thought this was a sweet poly bag, especially the little figure. I love that stand. I'm just like, gosh, I gotta love that stand. Um, but it's still, I think, the number one poly bag that if, if they're, I think they have more, I'm probably gonna pick a few of these up and give them away because I just think they're, I just think they rock. And of course, they got the Iron Man one, which was probably my second best. But so far, that is overall my top best. Anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think of this little thing. You guys can leave it in the comments. Definitely forget to, uh, don't forget to thumbs up this video. All right, Fox fans, have a good one.